We're going to take a look at how a pop-up timer works. So in most of the turkeys that you buy in the grocery store, there's a little plastic pop-up timer. And I think we can actually switch to the camera and show you what it looks like. Maybe you'll recognize it once you see it. So these are a pop-up timer. The one on your left is what it looks like when it is inside the turkey. The one on the left is one that's been cut away. We really wanted to know how these worked. So Dr. Slagle, who's over here in the red sweater, and I one day spent a lot of time doing calculations on a napkin of gas laws to figure out what the pressure would have to be inside the pop-up timer in order to make it work. And then we decided just for the fun of it that we would cut it open after we had done all the kinetics and numerous calculations. And we found out that what it really is is a spring, a plunger with a spring, and a small drop of solder. So it's fully encased in plastic. The plunger is depressed. When the solder melts, the plunger is released. Now the solder they've chosen just happens to melt at the same temperature that a turkey is considered done, which is 185 degrees Fahrenheit. So the pop-up timer cares nothing about your turkey. It really doesn't care at all. It really is obeying just the scientific principle of melting at a certain temperature. Once it melts, it releases the plunger and it comes up. Quite simple, quite elegant. It's really nice to see science in a simplistic form.